And we're back with renowned travel expert Pauline Fromer with advice on how to spend less and see more in Cancun and Yucatan. And before we were cut off before, Pauline, we were talking about some great deals from Toronto to Cancun, around $600. Well, that's what they start at, believe it or not. And that is not only for airfare, that's for a full week of hotel nights mm -hmm. at some very glamorous resorts right on the beach. And, and you've got some great ideas. You've just come back from Cancun, and you have some great ideas for consumers who want to spend less but still see more. Yes, you want to book air hotel packages. That's the way to, to save the most money. And if you're finding that the prices you're being quoted are too high, go to another supplier. Uh, every, every place in the world right now needs more tourism. People are staying home in record numbers. So it's a buyer's market out there. Do not be afraid to bargain. And don't be afraid to maybe upgrade. Uh, sometimes you'll get the best prices on the five-star hotels. Really mm. glamorous, beautiful beautiful places in Cancun because those are the ones that tend to sell out the last now Cancun is, or in Mexico in general is being very very aggressive of course because of the devastating uh, tourist industry that they've had right now because of H1N1 so they're doing they're pulling out all the stops it seems to get us down there they really are and you're going to find all kinds of special events going on when you go to Cancun and and special events that simply happen in nature uh, when I was there I was able to swim with the whale sharks which was a once-in-a-lifetime really? experience yeah every year from May through September the whale sharks are in the waters outside Cancun these are the world's largest fish I was swimming in a pod of about 40 whale sharks all of whom were 40, 50 feet long. It was just extraordinary. I was told, don't get too close to them. I had to swim backwards to avoid touching them. Wow. Uh, it, was, it was a once-in-a-lifetime experience, great for families. And that's something that really, when we go down, um, uh, Canadians tend to travel down to Mexico in the, in the winter months, and of course, you would miss that whole activity. So it is a good idea to kind of come in in what is considered our off-season, but certainly it's a very busy time the summer is in Mexico. Sure, but in winter you can swim with dolphins, mm -hmm. you can visit ancient ruins, you can go to glamorous restaurants. Uh, Cancun has things to do year-round, but, but yes, you're right. Until September, this once-in-a-lifetime experience of swimming with the whale sharks is available. Okay, Pauline Fromer, so nice to talk to you again. That's a renowned travel expert with her expertise on Cancun 